All right, pinball fans, today I'm going to show you what this red writing means and um, how you could fix it. But, a little disclaimer, you shouldn't, okay? This is personal preference, though, but like I said, I'm going to show you how you, what to set, and then you can go from there. Um, so you're going to need two things. You're going to need a tape measure, ruler with centimeters, okay? You're going to need a level. Um, I use an app. You need to use an app on your phone. Um, that way you can place it on your cab and get the degree of the inclination. Okay. Um, most, if it's a standard cab, it's like 14, 13, 14. Um, so we'll guesstimate on here uh, since I'm on my desktop. But okay. So this right here, I'm going to show you how to get it out. All right. So we're going to leave here. Close this down. <clears throat> I'm going to open GL and in your tables folder you have a screen if you updated the new 10.8 you have a screen size calibration table alright we're going to open this alright and we're going to go to preferences video graphics ops alright so basically what it's saying we need to set all these numbers for your cabinet layout and how you do that is you just measure, okay? So we're going to measure my screen uh, centimeters. It's about 70. I don't know if you can see that. So I got 70. How wide? And it's about 40, okay? So 70, 40. Like I said, the inclination, you can download the app on your phone. Place it on your screen, like so. It's about 13, 14 degrees. We'll put, um, that's what we're going to put. We're going to put 70 in here. 40 in here. Uh, I'll go back and show you this. Try to record this screen, too. Uh, matter of fact, I'll do that at the same time. Let's see. A good range is like 70 to 80, so. All right. Then once you do that, hit OK. Then we're going to hit F6 on our say size uh, calibration table. Okay. And here it is. Now basically what we got to do, we're going to have to go down to where X, Y, Z is um, both highlighted. And then we're going to go out to 100. Okay. We need to get it to 100%. And this is going to check your numbers. And it's pretty much spot on. Okay, all right. Now we've got that, and then we have to move it. So we're going to have to go back up. We're going to move this, and you got to make sure that it's zero is at the very bottom of your screen. It needs to be zero. Okay, there's zero. So basically, you make it till the blue goes away, and then you can read it at the top. And look at there, mine's right on. Mine was dead on almost. So it's uh, 69 and a half is what mine reads. And I put 70, so I can go back and put 69 and a half just to uh, make sure it's perfect. All right, so 69 and a half. Now I'll go up, and i got to move this over. i am got to make sure it's zero on the left side of the screen. And then I read the right side. So it's so I'm dead on 39. Okay, so 16, 69 and a half, I'll write that down, and 39. All right, we're going to go back. We're going to go put our numbers in. So 69.5 and 39. Okay, then we hit OK. We're going to hit File, Save for our uh, screen calibration table. And then you're going to hit File, Export, POV. All right. Hit Save. Now, close that out. Once you go to open up one of your tables now, so let's open up Police Force. Since you guys knew what it looked like before, it gives you options now. So we're going to hit F6, and it'll let you select the new mode. So see, now I don't have the red writing anymore, and it tells you um, 
magnus save previous plunger key so basically you can hit enter and it does two different views as opposed to set a stretch to fit if you can read that pov stretch to fit or no, no stretching all right it's supposed to auto size but i do not like it do not like it for some people where their screen fits good um i notice on this 2k uh, it does not now you could uh take it as it is you could do some fine adjustments maybe but that's how you calibrate that and uh yeah it just does not look right for me okay